Okay guys, what's up? How's everyone doing? This is my second Minecraft video. Uh, Handsome Minecraft, video number two, if you will. Um, there seems to be some sort of Enderman nearby. Just heard him, definitely. Um, to start off, I'd like to say I don't think that we're going to be having any more wood problems anytime soon. I made sure of that. If I run out of wood, well... I'm definitely doing something wrong. So the first thing that I'm going to try and do today is uh, possibly build a build a garden, start start growing some crops, probably some wheat somewhere out here in the front yard. I'll do a little uh, nine by nine plot. There is the Enderman. I found him. I'm tempted to try and fight him, but I don't know if I could. I think he would probably kill me, and I really don't want to risk it. It would be a shame. Then again. I do live right here, and I'm only level 3. All my stuff would be right here still. You know what? Let's try it. Oh. Yep, guys, that was a bad idea. Oh, my gosh. Whoa. Let's hurry up and go get my stuff. Oh my goodness, that was that was bad. Okay, at least all of my stuff is still right here. That's the good news. I don't see any uh unusual items like the the Enderman Pearl or the Eye of Ender or whatever you get from those guys. I don't see any of that, so I obviously didn't kill him. I thought I did at the last hit, but no. He just uh got real mad and then left. So back to what I was saying before. Today we're gonna try and do a uh crop crop of wheat uh first thing i'm going to do is uh since i need to be able to put a square in the middle of this crop of water uh i need to be able to carry water so i actually have to go craft a bucket and to do that i need iron ingots so the first thing i'm going to do is go find some iron and then i will check back in with you guys okay and i forgot to mention earlier it would actually be a wise decision for me to go ahead and try and collect some coal as well uh just so i can get an abundance of torches that's one thing that I like to have a lot of whenever I go anywhere, especially mining. Uh, just to be able to see down there in the uh, darkness, when you're so far underground, you you really don't want to get lost. And not to mention, it seems that with these kind of graphical enhancements, uh, it when it gets dark, it really gets dark, and it's really hard to see. So torches are more important than ever now. Um, so as you can see, there's my little house over there. And I just was kind of wandering around because I noticed that there's plenty of little holes in the ground that kind of lead to dark and mysterious places such as this one. So we're going to go ahead and go down there real quick and see what we can find. Um, looking for coal, looking for iron. And uh, I do believe some coal here. I'm not going to spend too much time looking for coal right now. Uh, just a little bit will will be fine. My main objective right now is to find iron. I just need three iron ingots. Uh, then I can craft a bucket, then I can get started on that crop I was telling you guys about. Okay, right over here. Oh, 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 that's not good. Oh, that's really not good. Oh my gosh. Oh, guys. Oh, this is going terribly. Well, the good news is, I know exactly where he is, and I'm going to get revenge right now. That was very stupid of me. I was not prepared to see a... Uh, an archer in gold armor right down there below the surface. Not very far down below the surface, might I add. He should be right up here still. Just kill him as fast as I can. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my god. That's two times now. So this is hard mode for you. Alright guys, one more time. Third time's a charm, that's what they say. So let's go for it. Sword. There you are. Third time is the charm, but just barely. Just barely. Uh, I guess something else I'm going to have to do as soon as I can is craft some pretty durable armor because that was ridiculous. That took me three three deaths. Two deaths, three deaths. Uh, at, at point is, that took way too, way too long to kill that guy. And I'm sure he's one of the weaker things I'm going to come across. So as soon as I get this crop going... I think armor is the next thing to look out for. 
But uh, lucky for us, I found one iron block at least right here just below the surface. If you find one, there's normally more than one. And looks like I found three, which is just what I needed. I'm definitely not going to pass up the chance to get more iron as quickly as I can, so I'm going to go ahead and mine the rest of this. I might have enough iron to actually craft a piece of armor, which would be a tremendous help because as you have seen so far, these guys are no joke on hard mode, on uh, PC especially. Oh, oh, that is not good. Not good, not good. I'm going to have to come back for that iron. I am not dying again if I ca can avoid it. All right. At least I'm alive. Let's see. Some. What happened to all my meat? Oh, man. I had like seven cooked muttons that I was going to eat. But I guess they're still down there or the Enderman took them or something. That's very, very unfortunate. But I have uh, two, two breads. Yes, two breads and two apples. So that will have to do. Okay, let's see. I picked up a couple of those iron ingots. Oh, more than a couple, actually. Eight? I did not even realize I found eight. Coal's there. Iron ore's there. Okay, perfect. We're going to use wood. Because I have plenty of wood now to go ahead and use as uh, my uh, burning material. Since I only have 18 coal, I kind of want to use that solely for torches. That's going to help me out way more. And I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and use every single coal I just acquired for torches. You can truly never have enough in this game. Pick up my three and we'll go ahead and craft that bucket. I believe this is the way to do it. Yes. Perfect. Bucket acquired. It's definitely nighttime. 100%. 100% nighttime. I'm going to sleep through this. I'm trying not to die any more times. Uh, let's see if I can make it through this whole video without dying any more times. Because I think I've, think I've died enough. But hey, at least I'm not those guys. Oh. He just put himself out. I wonder if he meant to do that or if he was just running because he was on fire and just scared. I wonder what he's going to do. That guy died though. He didn't know what to do. I'm going to try and make a, uh, a hoe. Yes. So I guess right here, right next to my house is as good a place as any. Just going to clear a little bit of this out and make a 9x9. Nine nine. Oh my god. That guy's on fire. Oh! 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 Eat him. That's uh, normally what I do. But let's try something different this time, right? Middle block. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. One, two, three, four, five. Right here. So that is where my water is going to go. And it should... Uh, supply water to everything else around here so it'll all grow. Water bucket, nice. Awesome. Put that there. Yeah. So it's supposed to look something like this. Nine by nine, the very center square is water and then all of the ground around it is going to stay hydrated. It's nighttime sleep through that oh my god my door's open one step further along on this journey of growing a, a crop in minecraft so i got my fence i'm gonna go ahead and put that all around okay and there is a way to make a gate i know that much i really don't need rotten flesh i really don't okay just what i thought and perfect uh that'll do That'll do. So now we have a nine by nine plot. The square in the middle is filled with water as to hydrate all of these squares around it. The fence is up. The fence has gates. I can go inside and exit as I please. The only next step would be to go ahead and put the seeds in. I guess I had to look this up too, but I guess you find wheat seeds by just hitting tall grass you have like a 10 percent chance of finding wheat seeds once you break open tall grass uh 
and I have got some seeds. I guess I guess those are wheat seeds, supposedly. So by that logic, I can run around here breaking down all the grass that I see and get a couple of wheat seeds, and probably enough to start off my little uh, wheat crop. I have enough seeds to fill uh, my entire garden up. Oh boy go around I guess this is the whole process I just start putting them down and then they start to grow I think that's how nature works isn't it great that we have games that teach kids this is like super wheat got wheat growing all in here this is the first time I've ever actually made a farm on here or any kind of crop made it look so good this is uh I'm actually kind of proud of this okay so while the uh, crop is growing outside I'm going to go ahead and use some of this other iron that I found to make some armor because I was getting slaughtered out there by anything and everything. Look at that. Look at that. There we go. There we go. Look at that helmet. All right. So I guess I'm just going to go ahead and sleep through the night and then we'll go out and see how the crops did. All right. Here we go. Day two of the crop. Now let's go ahead and see what happens. What did I get? Right click does nothing. And that is just giving me seeds. So I guess this is not ready. Okay, so I just looked up a guide yet again um, on wheat in Minecraft. It looks like I fell down. Uh, wheat will go through eight stages of growth on this game. And once it starts turning slightly brown is when it's ready to be harvested. Some of those look like they're getting there, but I think those are the same ones that I already tried harvesting and then nothing happened. I am going to go ahead and put some of these acacia saplings that I found while I was wandering around getting all that wood. I'm going to put these right here in front of my house. Hopefully they'll grow and then just give the house just a little bit better of a look. I know I still need to do a lot of improving on this. I'm definitely going to get to that, definitely. This is kind of the bare minimum house for me. I mean, I guess there's a little bit of flair with this front porch, but yeah, this is this is far from completed, I'll tell you that much. This is going to be a grand house. Wheat check. Uh, I see a couple in there that are looking pretty brown, but we're going to give it a little while longer. I want more of these to uh start growing. And you know what, guys? While we're waiting on paint to dry, I think I'm going to go ahead and put a dock out here for a boat that I'm eventually going to make. This definitely looks like the perfect grounds to do that. Eventually, I just want to take a boat, ride out back in that direction, see how far I can go, and uh, see if I can get lost out in the big ocean. Okay, and nighttime happened like nobody's business, so I'm going to go ahead and sleep through that very quickly, then get back to my dock. I gotta stop doing that. Okay, dock is built. Didn't really take a whole lot of work. It's coming along. It really is. You know what? In addition to uh, wheat, let's go out and, and, and find some animals. Because uh, protein is very important. And as far as I know, you don't get that from wheat. It's good for wool. You don't, you don't get the same kind of wool from a cow as you would from a sheep. That is lava. I'm going to fight this rabbit, though. Come back. Come back. There. All right. Maybe I could sneak up on this one. I'll try. Oh, no, nope, that is not working. For all you animal lovers out there, I uh I definitely do apologize. I know this must be very traumatic for you. I get the feeling that real rabbits would be a little easier to catch than this. Maybe not. I haven't actually tried to catch a rabbit in real life. I don't even know where I am anymore. Two raw rabbits, that's what I'm coming home with. And a raw chicken, I don't remember getting it. Don't know. Hey, a cow. This is what I was looking for the whole time. Finally. Four. Five, six, and seven cows. What a haul. Jeez, what's better than steak and wheat? That's my preferred choice of meal. I uh, just a note to all you future Minecraft players out there. Swords. Very sharp. Okay, I think that's the end of the cows. Alright. Sleep through the night. I can only sleep at night. Well, I thought it was night. Okay, so I got some, got some raw beef. A little bit. Also got leather. 
wasn't even aiming for leather, but I have it. I actually have enough to make some armor. I guess we'll do pants. Why not? Okay, so let's go ahead and start cooking some of this beef. Let's do wood planks. Stick some of those in there. Let's do the rabbit. This will be a food chest. This one will be food only. I like to keep these things organized. Um, eventually, I'm going to run out of room in here, so I'll have to upgrade the house at some point. Maybe put on a second story. Maybe dig down, get a basement going. Or maybe just expand on the side. I do have plenty of options here. I mean, there's just so much room in all directions. Now, that looks like some wheat that is ready to be harvested. That's that's brown on the edges there, on the tips. Brown on the tips. On the tips. Okay, all the steaks are cooked. Cooked rabbit. Yum. Yum. Put that chicken in there. Now for the wheat. You know what? That looks like a couple of these are done. A lot of them are almost done. So I'm gonna go in here and harvest some of that good wheat. And there you have it. I have wheat now. Beautiful. Let's see, let's go ahead and harvest some more. I think it's normal to have to replant wheat after you break it, I think. I'm not sure. Seven wheats, can't go wrong there. Put some of this in the chest, safekeeping. I think that about wraps it up for this video. Uh, video number two, Lemon at Last channel. Um, yep, made a, made a nine by nine wheat crop. Nothing fancy, but it gets the job done. Also was able to throw in a uh, small little dock out the back for uh, future boats, future boats and whatnot. Built a little bit of armor, found some coal, found some iron, made a bucket. Yep, that about does it, guys. Alrighty, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.